Steph Curry in particular. At least you tried. I don't even know how to feel about the Warriors season. The only thing I can compare to the Warriors season is a job application. You fill out the job application, you play through the season, you put in the resume. AKA you want the playoffs so bad, you go 73 and nine. Best record in the NBA. They invite you to an interview. AKA you make it to the NBA finals. And then after you go through all that, they tell you, you know what? We've decided to move on to another applicant. AKA you get there, they realize you're black, and then they say, you know what, we're going to give it to the little Asian over there. They give your job to Ling Ling. AKA, LeBron shows up and ruins it for everybody. LeBron, what you doing out there and playing basketball? You need to be out there running some routes for the Browns since you want to be in Cleveland so bad. Get out there and run me a slant route since you want to be out there running so hard. I swear, every time LeBron run, he running for slavery. Every time LeBron take off, I swear I see Kunta Kente running with him. I be like, ain't this some history? I know Steph Curry is still mad. And it's not because he looks like a 12-year-old boy still. Or the fact that he doesn't look like Riley Curry's daddy, but her older brother. He's mad because in the finals, in game seven, he didn't play like Steph Curry. Or Chef Curry as we have come to know him. Nah fam, he played like Stephen Curry. Whoever that is.